Hey, so you're looking for a modular helmet with inbuilt comms? Well, look no further. Arguably, no one is better at producing helmet cons than Senna, and Senna now have their own brand of reasonably priced helmets, both full faced and modular, with the comms built straight into them. Now, I know if you're looking at this video, you probably already know this, but did you know that one of Senna's flagship helmets, the Senna Outrush R, which retails here for $599 here in Australia, can be purchased for around about $350. Interested? Stick around for the next few minutes, and that's all it's going to take you to watch this video, and we'll show you how to make that saving with absolutely no risk. So sit back, prepare to save a bundle, courtesy of that Harley couple. Hi guys, thanks for joining us once again. Today we have a solution to those of you looking for a new helmet that won't break the bank. Let me give you a very short background as to how we found this product at such a great price. The tail gunner and I have been struggling with this crap, cheap rubbish intercom, for way too long. And on a recent interstate ride we decided it was time to splash out in a new system. Now it's clear there's only two brands that are worth considering, Cardio or Senna. So most people wouldn't simply know that they buy what their riding buddies use. It makes common sense so that everybody's on the same system. But that really didn't matter to us. We're happy. We normally just ride together. We just wanted to talk to each other. Now, this also happened to coincide with the fact that it was time for us to update our old helmets, which were now five years old. I've been looking at modular helmets the last couple of months after being convinced by a workmate that they're, well, God's gift to motorcycling, and I decided it would be a great time to do some research on them. Thanks, Harps, by the way. So you can imagine how rapt I was to learn that Senna themselves were now producing modular helmets with the comms built straight into them. The Senna Outrush R kept popping up in my searches, and it, after watching countless videos, we decided that yeah, it could be pretty much the perfect solution for what we wanted. The only stumbling block was it was going to cost us around $1,200 for two. This is where it gets interesting. Stick with me here, we're about to blow your mind, that's for sure. Okay? What if I told you that without leaving home you could change that price from $599 down to $399? And that includes all taxes and postage. That's a $200 or 33% saving. By buying at the right time even, you can actually increase that saving by around another 20%, which brings the price of the helmets down to about $325, $328 each. So if I walk into the shop here, it's gonna cost me about $1,198 for two. We got two delivered to the door for just on $650. That's right, if I walked into the shop here, any shop selling the Senna Outrush R, I'd have paid $1,198. But because we bought them on the Black Friday sale online, we saved 45%. Now that is a bargain. How do we do this? Simple, the answer is Google. So. I was typing Senna Outrush R into Google and I kept getting these adverts popping up for the big European motorcycle parts company. Two in particular, Moto Storm and Moto IN. My immediate thought was to just disregard these because they're bound to be scams or you'll never see the parts, whatever you buy, that sort of thing. But curiosity got the better of me. So I decided to probe a little bit deeper. So after looking at lots of online reviews, I can tell you that both had their fair share of bad reviews, which at first was another reason for me to sort of shy away. But after going through lots of these negative reviews, it became clear very fast that the biggest issue most people had was buying from these companies was their delivery times that tended to blow out. So lots of reviews taking it took up to six weeks to deliver packages that should take six days. Okay, well speed wasn't really an issue for us, so with the prospect of saving that much hard earned coin, I thought, hey, why do you give it a crack? Let's look a little bit deeper at this. The main thing I was looking for were, are these companies legit, and will these helmets ever get here? 
So to save myself any possible heartache, the next thing I checked was, can you pay with PayPal? Okay, I was happy to see that the answer to all of these questions was yes. For all those that don't know, if you purchase something with PayPal and it doesn't turn up, PayPal themselves investigate, and if the supplier can't prove that you got your item or that it wasn't in the condition that you they described, then PayPal sends you your money back. No problems. So the risk was minimal and the possible reward was pretty brilliant, I thought. So we decided to give it a shot. Now it just happened that the night we decided to buy them, MotoStorm were having a Black Friday sale, a whopping 40% off the helmets, which even after adding taxes and postage meant that two outrush hours were going to cost us just $320 each, $28 each. Yep, you heard right, two $599 helmets for $328. Couldn't resist, so we pulled the trigger. And now we decided it's just time to settle in. We're expecting these things to take six to ten weeks to get to us. And we were prepared to wait. To be, to be fair, I was actually a, a little bit sceptical that they'd actually ever arrive. So, as I said, we settled in and it went something like this. So there you have it. It took a grand total of eight days from order being placed online to the big box arriving at the front door. I had a friend do the same. His only took five days. So now, I'm not gonna do a full review of the helmets, but I can say I'm already a convert to modular helmets. Absolutely bloody brilliant. Uh, where have they been my whole life? And having a crisp, clear conversation with the tail gunner while we're out on a ride, fantastic. The phone uh, connection to them is also brilliant. So I'd say that when I do do a review, it's probably going to be pretty positive. All right. Now I hear some of you say, well, why don't you support the local motorcycle industry? And, and to that I just say, well, you know what? If I can get them here at that price, why can't they? Now I don't think that uh, Moto Storm are a uh, not-for-profit organisation, so they're making money. And if they're making money, how can the local guys add a further $200 onto that? It, it just doesn't make sense and it's not fair and, and quite frankly I call bullshit on it. So the old saying is, I guess, a fool and their money are easily parted. Well, if it had only been 50 or 60 bucks, I'd have happily bought it here. But when you're looking at $200 per helmet, you know, the, the choice was simple as far as I was concerned. Anyway, Moto Storm did alright by us. I reckon an eight day for us and a five day for me mate to get them to here, us was uh, absolutely sensational. They're the exact same helmet you would buy in the shop, made by Centre of Italy. Moto Storm come from Italy. I don't know where they actually shipped them to us from because I don't believe that they would have come from Italy in eight days, but hey, who cares? Anyway, hopefully this is going to save you some money. Have a look if you're not interested in the Centre out Russia, maybe look at their other helmets maybe look at some of their other products because as far as I'm concerned they're pretty good to deal with and as I said if you use PayPal not a problem all right I hope this video has saved you a few dollars if it has or even if it just interests you do us a favor hit that subscribe button so we'd love to grow our channel we'd love you to come along with us for the journey so we can bring you more bargains like this and lots of other motorcycle content so until next time stay vertical Ride safe, and we'll see you on the next episode of That Harley Couple. Cheers.